Created for the victims of the Waukesha Parade tragedy has now surpassed $2 million. Rebecca Clough goes in depth on how the money donated is going to be given out. Organizers for the United for Waukesha Community Fund say they want to start getting the money donated into the hands of the victims in the next few weeks. Flowers, candles, and crosses sit as a reminder of just how many people have been touched by the tragedy at the Waukesha Christmas Parade last Sunday. Also as a memorial, many in the community donated to a fund set up by the Waukesha County Community Foundation and the United Way. We knew we wanted to do something that was going to be trusted um, by people who were making donations. And really that's what the United Way and Waukesha County Community Foundation does day in, day out. The money raised by the fund is housed within the Waukesha County Community Foundation, but a committee of people that include the mayor's office, the county executive's office, the school district and community organizations will decide how the funds will be given out. We're in the preliminary stages of uh, looking at how that will be distributed. We're really modeling it, unfortunately, off of other tragedies that have happened around the country. One of the models is the Boston Marathon Bombing Fund. It had a tiered system to decide how much money each victim would receive and that is the plan for this fund. The first tier will be families of those who died. The second will be hospitalized victims and the third will be non hospitalized victims who received medical treatment. In that category of hospitalized victims, are, is there going to be a scale? Do some people get more, some people get less money, or is everybody going to get the same amount? What they've done in other communities when it's come to hospitalization, they have actually looked at number of days hospitalized and used that as the metric for deciding or determining um, different payouts. And so it's not going to be based on a broken arm versus a fractured skull. It's going to be based on hospitalization days. The Boston Marathon Bombing Fund gave out more than $80 million to more than 200 victims. The United for Waukesha Community Fund says they're still raising money and still trying to determine the number of victims. That will help them determine the metric that will be used to compensate them. There's a whole category of individuals that seek or sought medical attention that we're not sure um, how many people will be in that category. The mayor's office hopes to have some of those answers by the end of the week so money can start going out to victims. Reporting in Waukesha, Rebecca Clough, TMJ4 News.